Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Distant Worlds Universe. We are pushing forward in our war. We're probably going to try to take Urine Scoot and maybe even push back against these guys on this side of the map. So that's uh, what we're going to be doing first. But first, I need to uh, build some more some more ships. We're going to build another big fleet this time. Uh, 15 frigates. Um, I've upgraded the designs, by the way. Uh, 15 destroyers, 20 cruisers. 15 carriers that will be what uh 30 50 65 ships purchase for all those creds um and then what we're gonna do is open the ships and bases and find military ships that aren't in a fleet aren't in a fleet i said we're gonna select them all and give a new fleet this will be uh, this fleet, not the 12th fleet, but the 4th fleet. All right. Cool. So we're going to have lots of new ships in the 4th fleet. 3rd um, fleet hopefully gets to help out here. 1st fleet needs refueling and repairs. 2nd fleet also needs repairs. And the troops fleet needs more troops. Load troops at Kappa 2. Are you, do you got troops ready for me? You got some, it looks like. We're doing really good there right now. I've turned this game around pretty ridiculously, actually. It's pretty impressive how, how well this game has uh, turned around. Uh, the third fleet is not in the system yet. I want the third fleet to engage these guys. Uh, we also do have a pirate problem, uh, which I should show you. As you guys can see, we have this pirate problem. Um, these guys have facilities already built. These guys are building facilities. I'm, I'm training troops to try to you know counter these guys as much as I can. These guys have two facilities built, so we're going to have to, or are building two facilities, so we're going to have to definitely get some defensive forces here, and we're recruiting some forces here as well to handle these guys. Uh, pirates take over your shit after building three facilities, so um, these guys are going to warp off. Where are they going? Well, uh, I guess we'll have you continue to repair. Enemy 8th Fleet is coming to where the 4th Fleet's going to be, but where the 2nd Fleet is. So that seems foolish. And they're actually, like, coming straight to, like... Yeah, this is a really interesting decision. They're, they're coming to attack my spaceport, which is real strong. They don't have, they're not landing ground troops, are they? No, they're not, so. Do they have troop transports here? Any of these troop transports? No. Now the game's lagging a bit, which is kind of funny, but. These guys are rebelling again. And the problem here is that eventually they will succeed. Ibraib is rebelling. What about Dalashi? Okay, they're, they're, look, appear to be done with their rebelling instincts. Um, second fleet's the one that's engaged. Get, yeah, I don't know what the master plan here was with their eighth fleet. This kind of looks like a, feels like a desperation maneuver. But yeah, they're, they're, they're dead now. Oh, and another ship just arrived, but it's going to not last very long. Yep. So I want to zoom to the sector view. Cool. One ship remains from the 8th fleet. That, well, that was a really odd life decision that they made here. Really odd. I, I will not deny that at all. 9 infantry, 7 armor. I guess I can move into the Firmus system. So that's what we'll do. Troop fleet. Let's just move to the Firmus. The Firmus planet. We'll take Firmus for our own that will be good i didn't realize i was slightly off like offset with my how i was speaking so i was being a little quiet there i apologize um 
So, fourth fleet. You are slowly but surely coming online. That's good. Third fleet's repairing. First fleet is also repairing. Second fleet, desperate need of repairs. There really needs to be a way to have fighters go home. Like, just say, please have your fighters go home. In fact, uh, like, if I, or just not even display fighters, maybe. Advanced settings. Nope. Um, yeah, weird. Anyway, let's keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Six fleet. So I want the six fleet. To attack the planet. No, not the Sixth Fleet. The Troops Fleet. Attack the planet. Sixth Fleet. I really don't want you to attack the planet. Very well done. Bring in the ground forces. Take the planet. Should have, yeah, some more forces coming off. We have a new fleet admiral. Oh, and I forgot, I haven't used my intelligence agents in forever. I need them to do stuff. All right, fleet admiral. You need to go to the fourth fleet. Have any other admirals that need to fleets to command? You need to go to the second fleet. Um, and we'll have you stay in command of the third fleet for now. Um, intelligence agents, cancel your mission. Go against the Zell. Steel research. They have high density alloys, not gravitic weapons. High density alloys. Let's get those. Cancel. Zell. Steel research. You have. Um. Advanced proton ionization. Let's get that as well. All right, cool. So yeah, we'll take this without any difficulty. God, those guys keep rebelling. Um, should we warn the Grim Horde? No, we'll keep that information to ourselves. Recent space battle at Kappa Two. There was a space battle at Kappa Two. That seems like a surprise to me and everybody else. Do we have ships that just can't get here? Yeah, it's the same problem. These ships can't, like, move closer to the thing. Now, now you're in here. You got one damage component, and you're fully operational. You are in there, and you're good. You're in there, and you're good. I think you're in there. Yeah. You're in there, and you're in there. All right, and then the third fleet. You will never make it in there, so you're going to get retired. Yes, I could send a construction ship out, but that's okay. And you're not going to make it in either, so... If I have you third... F this ship... I wish there was an easy way to be like... I guess I can do it like this, yeah. Scrap ship. Alright, cool. What did we just finish researching here? Stealth. That will give me uh, the ultra long range scanner, which I want in the future, but not at this very moment. Um, let's get research upgrade. Followed by officer training, I think. Yeah. We need some more research stations as well, I realize. Yeah, we should build some more research stations. So let's uh, look for potential research locations. Um, let us build weapons research station there. I'm looking at places within our territory for now. So yeah, that's there. Okay, so you, I should be able to build a high-tech research station there. Not very good, but okay. Another weapons research location. I want to use the scenery bonus on both of those. Get the tourism stuff going back. 
Is there any energy research locations in my territory? God, that would be a good one way out there, but you're, I mean, that's like, hey, let's, let's build one out there and see what happens. <laughs> All right, cool. Um, so we have jointly taken control of this planet. Um, I'm going to have to send the six fleet, no, the troops fleet. Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to come here. I am going to garrison most of the infantry and some of the armored forces. Garrison selected troops. Then we'll load up the remaining troops. Uh, and then we'll take this other planet. We should be able to do that. Yeah, there's not a lot of people on this planet, so that should be an easy conquest. Then what we also need to do is come to Kappa. Recruit more assault forces and we also need to go to um cyber prime and recruit more forces cool second fleet i wish you were fully operational third fleet is fully operational so what i'm gonna do here is uh, go to the sixth fleet So what I want to do is have the 6th Fleet move just some, to some random location. Move to Firmus 8. Troops Fleet, you guys have to load troops. These guys are rebelling to overthrow our rule like a bunch of dingleberries. 6th um, Fleet. Now what I want you to do is disband 6th Fleet. Disband Fleet. And have you guys all join the third fleet. This will make the third fleet a nice, strong fleet. And then we'll have the third fleet come to planet Firmus to give uh, space superiority bonuses and all that good stuff. So that will be good. Yeah, this is going really well. Enemy 8th Fleet is causing us problems, but that's okay. 2nd Fleet, not quite ready. 1st Fleet, almost ready. Enemy 10th, 20th Fleet is going to Gundar. 4th um, Fleet is not fully constructed. So what we're going to have to do is send the 1st Fleet, which is not quite ready to come here, to... Uh, so they're coming down to this planet. All right. We need to come here now. First fleet needs to come here now. Two ships. Not fully operational yet, but that's okay. Let's go, first fleet. We have fended off an invasion on this moon. Are you a troop transport? No, you're a destroyer who's just doing something, apparently. Are you unloading troops? Or are you just being a dick? You're just being a dick. Speaking of dicks, we gotta take care of these pirates. So uh, let's finally take care of these pirates. 11 should probably be enough to attack. Um, five, I really want six to feel comfortable here. We have six here, so that will give us a nice use case. Not sure that that's enough for those two. This one isn't finished yet, so let's see what we got here. Some of these should be done. All right, so we have slight population bonus there. Population, enough population there. Definitely enough population there. And we'll see about this other one. All right. Troops fleet, have you fully take gotten all the troops you can? Should be enough to attack this planet, so let's do it. Our forces are invading the colony of Plessy. The first fleet has arrived. Oh, and everybody's fully operational, apparently. For, you know, for, an, for another 80 seconds or so, but that's okay. Yep, you were fully operational, now you're unfully operational. 
but we are doing a great job picking on these guys. God, these fighters are so good. It's too bad they lag so much, but they do such a good job. Get those anti-jump drives back up. Put down a rebellion on Firmus. Sounds like Thermus. So we crush those guys. How many of their ships escaped? That's what we'll find out here by zooming out. Five of their ships escaped. Have you guys go refuel and repair. Third fleet's doing great here. Troops fleet is preparing to unload. On to please here. We took please. Troops fleet, I would still like if you came and unloaded the remainder of your forces here. You're not, yeah, there's the remainder of the forces. Because these guys might rise up and that's not what I want. So. There we go. Get some more forces down. That's what I like to see. All right, troops fleet. Let's have you move all the way back down to Cyber Prime. Two. The enemy 10th fleet has decided to engage us here, which strikes me as foolish. But okay. Yep, this is once again a absolutely ingenious. Let's see how we're doing um, with our with our battles. We're still waiting for forces here. We're gonna lose this one. We might win that one, and we're waiting for more forces here. So all right, first fleet, you guys can refuel and repair. Second fleet is almost fully repaired. Third fleet's doing great. They just need um just need a little bit of fuel. Where are you going? Wow, you're going all the way out there. Hmm. What point do I end this war? That's really the question on everyone's mind. What point? Do I end the war? Uh, third fleet, let's get you to refuel. Fourth fleet is fully operational and just needs a little bit of fuel. So let's get the fourth fleet to fuel. Then we'll have the fourth fleet uh, jump in against these guys. And once you get to wherever you're going, which is back down here, I'll have you fuel there. So that, this is all going great. This is all going fantastically. Let's look at the rest of the world. They, oh, this is a real interesting thing going on over here. Not making as much money as we once were, so we're gonna have to keep track of, you know, maybe, maybe halt ship construction for a little bit. But we're doing good uh, in this realm, where the second strongest empire, the Zell, have been majorly hampered. Once the third fleet has refueled, we will uh, send them out again. Second fleet needs more, more ships. These guys are not happy with us. How about these guys? These guys love us because they're Sakurans and the Sakurans love us. The, uh, the Zell portion of this population does not like us. What's going on over here? How is this war going? Um, these guys are done with their whole rebelling process now. That's fine. Otherwise, this is a pretty good place to end this episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Once I get this extreme energy vortex, which is going to take forever, but once I get it, it's a huge leap for us. Um, anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. On the next episode, we're going to try to, I think... The goal is going to be able to, to move against Talos here. Talos is a large spaceport. Of course it is. Um, but yeah, I think we're going to want to move against Talos. Talos 2 is a pretty good planet. 
Talos 3 is a really good planet for us. I mean, the planet itself sucks, but the, the getting this sort of ingrained population is pretty good. Uh, let's look at Audros here. You're okay. Aredos, not Audros. You're okay. And you... You really suck, but you're Sakurin, and Sakurin is good because they like us. Anyway, with that all being said, we will be moving against this area and trying to stamp out this part of the Zell, and then and then maybe we'll peace out, or maybe we'll get Yurinskut too as well, I don't know. That all being said, though, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all next time.